Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about volume again, and we are going to be building a new chicken coop for our chickens. So we got some new little chicks coming in, so we need to have the volume of that coop. So your good job today is going to help build a coop or design a coop to be built using volume, right? All right, let's get to it. Hey, so let's get to building that coop for those chickens. So let's see that we have a building rectangular prism. So we are going to be building this rectangular prism. This is gonna represent our chicken coop. So let's say we're building a coop with these cubic dimensions. So each one of these little cubes has a one cubic foot. So I want you to figure out what the volume of this figure would be. If I was building my coop with these dimensions, what would be the volume? All right, hopefully you pause and saw this. Well, we can see that the length of this figure is going to be six feet. The width of this figure is going to be three feet. And the height of this figure is going to be four feet. So we can say that six times three is 18 and 18 times four is 72. So this figure, this coop would have a volume of 72 cubic feet. That's basically it, because remember, Volume is length times width times height, or six times three times four. And that's all there is to volume solving. But let's say that we know we want the length to be seven feet. We know that we want the width to be five feet. And I know I want the volume of the coop to have 245 cubic feet. So if I want the volume to be 245, what is the height of this figure gonna be? Now there's a couple ways to figure this out. I want you to see, pause and see if you can figure this out. Okay, hopefully you did. Uh, one way is to multiply. Well, we know that seven times five is 35. And you could say 35 times, we, we know 35 times one is only gonna be 35. So you can do some guessing and checking. So 35 times five, 35 times six, 35 times seven, something like that to see if you can get 245 or you can list the multiples. Well, you know one layer is going to be 35 feet. We know that the second layer, if we add them up, is 70 feet. The third layer will be 105 cubic feet. Uh, the fourth layer is 140. Fifth is 175. Sixth is 210. And the seventh is 245 cubic feet. So we know that this is going to be seven feet. So again, you could list your multiples of 35, knowing that seven times five is 35, and that'll be the area of the base, or we can, we can just do some guess and check, 35 times six, 35 times five, and see what those come up with. All right, let's go ahead and go to the next one. So let's say I want to build a coop with these dimensions. What would the volume of this figure be? We'll hopefully pause the video and you tried to solve this. If not, go ahead. So if we're looking at this figure, we know the length is going to be seven feet. We know the width is going to be five feet. And we know the height is also going to be five feet. So again, volume is length times width times height. So we can find the area first, which would be seven times five, which is 35. And then we can multiply that by the height. So the basis. 35, the height is going to be 5, so 35 times 5 is 175. Excellent. All right, so let's go ahead and move on to the next one. So last one. So let's say I was wanting to build a cube. I want to build a cube chicken coop. So this is going to be the length of one side. So I want you to figure out what the volume would be. Go ahead and pause and see if you can do it. All right, well, if you figured this out, you know that the length is going to be six feet. The width is also six feet. And the height is also going to be six feet because it's a cube. All of them are going to be the same. So six times six is 36. 36 times six is 216. So the cube here would have 216 cubic feet. Let's put some walls on that bad boy. Uh, it could use a roof and a window and a little door. And all we need left is our chickies. So that's basically it. That's how we find volume going over this again, length times width times height or the base times height. All right, if you have any questions, please ask your teachers. Thanks for watching. Why are you on my head? Don't lay an egg up there, please.
Please don't lay an egg up there. Why are you up there again? How do I get you down? 